Matty Brennan coming to take it. Just barely inside the Mayo half. That seems to beat Backton forward. It's Mick Kearns with the ball. 30 yards out. Oh, that's a great point from Kearns. Tom Calirdy kicking. Oh, Kearns again. Mick Kearns. And it's another point. And just at the start of the second half, it's still 9-7 Mayo leading. Nice bit of weaving by Frank Henry. TJ Ferdahar seems to have control, and then suddenly Des Kearns has it. Long ball across, Mickey Kearns is in there, so is Seamus Riley, and it's going to be a penalty. It's going to be a penalty, it has to be a penalty for Sligo. And a penalty for Sligo, dramatic start of the second half, we're not even two minutes into it yet. If this is converted, Sligo would be a point ahead. Mick Kearns to take this penalty against Ivan Heffernan in the Mayo goal. And what a vital kick for Sligo and for Mick Kearns this is. Gets the signal. And it's a goal. Free for Sligo. Too many frees in this game, really, for any great continuity. Looking for Mick Kearns. Kearns blocking it down there into the hands of Des Kearns. A great goal! Time moving along. Seamus Riley to take the kick. Takes it now. And the game is over, and Sligo have won the Connacht Championship. Sligo have won the Connacht Championship for the first time since 1928, 47 years ago, and only their second ever. And look at those scenes of jubilation. And Mickey Curtins, we couldn't see him a moment ago with the crowds around him. Now he's shoulder high, surrounded by all his teammates, all the well wishers, and everyone in County Sligo would just love to be there. Mickey Curtins at long, long last, getting that much coveted. Connacht Championship medal and I think even Mayo people will not grudge it to him.